Hello everyone and welcome to my bold and beautiful today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. RJ's Treason, Poppy's Arrest, Brooks Festivity. The bold and the beautiful spoilers for Monday, August 12, 2024 are then. Suckers can anticipate Ridge Forrester and Brooke Logan to make big plans for the bedroom line. Eric Forrester plans a party. Katie Logan brings the police to arrest Penelope Poppy Nozawa. Plus, what happens when Luna Nozawa learns she was betrayed by R.J. Forrester? Keep reading to find out what's coming up in the coming occasion of the CBS Cleaner Pieces. The bold and the beautiful spoilers, R.J. Forrester's treason BNB spoilers for Monday, August 12th, reveal that Luna trusts R.J. So, she felt comfortable passing in him about her mama and Tom Starr's pack. The bold and the beautiful spoilers Monday, August 12th, R.J.'s treason, Poppy's arrest, Brooke's festivity indeed though R.J. allowed. He was doing the right thing by telling Katie, he should have given Luna a heads up. Who knows, perhaps RJ textbooks Luna right down and tells her. It wouldn't be veritably adulatory if characters did the right thing all the time, however. BNB Spoilers, Luna Nozawa's Discovery On Monday, August 12, suckers can anticipate Katie to take action after RJ's intel. Katie meets with Deputy Chief Bradley Baker. Now, Katie promised RJ she'd keep the information non-public. Katie didn't however, which means Luna will soon feel betrayed by RJ. That could buckle their love and shoot Luna running right into Zen Forrester Dominguez's arms. The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers, Poppy Nozawa's Arrest The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers for Monday, August 12th reveal that Katie will meet with Baker. Katie might tell Baker what RJ told her. Still, that's report and Baker might need further to go on. At some point, Baker does have a piece of substantiation, although I can't relatively tell what it's by the exercise clip. Katie goes with the police to Bill Spencer's place. As Bill stands there stupefied, Baker claims he's not there on a proposition, but on substantiation. Also, Poppy claims she didn't do anything wrong. Now, I'm not sure if the arrest will take place on Monday. It should be enough beforehand in the week, however. Monday, August 12, 2024 In Monday's occasion, Ridge and Brooke will continue making big plans for the bedroom line as well as Forrester creations. Plus, Eric will plan another party. A print shows Danny Romalotti and Carter Walton at the party. As Danny sticks a microphone in Carter's face, a redhead wearing meager white lingerie is seen at the party. I've to agree with the addict who participated in the world of BMB forum that Eric's manse is starting to look like the Playboy Mansion. Sheila's spicy shocker for Deacon, Katie calls Bobby's on Poppy. The bold and the beautiful spoilers recap for Friday, August 9th, reveals that Katie Logan reeled over RJ Forrester's updates on Tom Starr's pack being in Poppy Nozawa's apartment and the fact that she met with Tom the night he failed. RJ pushed Katie to be careful with this information before he picked up his pizza and took off. Meanwhile, Poppy returned to the apartment to defend her innocence again and was thankful when Luna Nozawa claimed she believed her mama. At home, Bill Spencer told Liam Spencer that he was concerned about Poppy since he'd this feeling in his gut that commodity was troubling her. Back at I.L. Giardino, Sheila Sharp gave Deacon Sharp a shoulder massage and learned that Katie had been asking questions related to Poppy. Once Katie returned from her discussion with RJ, Sheila admitted that she was the last bone. To see Paul Hollis Hollister alive. Katie asked if Hollis said anything, so Sheila noted that he wanted her to see commodity from Tom's pack. Still, Sheila assumed that pack was long gone since she told Hollis to get relief of it in the dumpster. Subsequently, Katie called Deputy Chief Bradley Baker to talk about Tom and Hollis' deaths since she allowed. She might have some substantiation. Over with Cleric, he choked on a special form Sheila made since she accidentally used two important can. Cleric guzzled milk and formerly again talked to Sheila about all Katie's questions about Poppy. Coming on Friday's BNB occasion, Katie headed to Bill's place and prompted him to hear since his life could depend on it. Bill was irked, but Katie brought up Tom's pack containing letters claiming he was Luna's father. Although Bill said he formerly knew, Katie claimed Poppy only told him half the story since she saw Tom right before he failed. 
Katie refocused out that Poppy awaited all this time to do a maternity test, and also Tom failed right after their meeting. Once Hollis set up the pack, he wound up dead, too. As Poppy entered, Katie claimed she was dangerous and left Bill asking if she allowed. Poppy was a killer. Yes, Bill. Yes. Katie cried as Poppy glared from the doorway. Grounded on our prognostications, someone other than Poppy is to condemn for Tom and Hollis' fatal issues, so stay tuned to see who'll figure that out. The bold and the beautiful spoilers say Poppy has some Bobby. Chaos coming up, so stick with us for further on news on her future. Police tip, Katie warns Bill, Poppy's killer interruption. The bold and the beautiful recap for Friday, August 9, 2024, is eventually then. Katie Logan made a call to the police. Katie also advised Bill Spencer that he's in love with a killer. On Moment's occasion, Penelope Poppy Nozawa tried to get Luna Nozawa to believe her story about Tom Starr's pack. Keep reading to find out what happened in the CBS Cleaner pieces. The bold and the beautiful spoilers, I.L. Giardino Death's BMB recap for Friday, August 9th reveal that at I.L. Giardino, Sheila Carter Sharp gives Deacon Sharp a massage. Cleric tells Sheila that Katie is asking questions about Penelope Poppy Nozawa. The bold and the beautiful recap Friday, August 9th police tip, Katie warns Bill, Poppy's killer interruption Katie is also suspicious about Tom and Paul Hollis Hollister's deaths. Sheila says that there could be answers in Tom's pack. Sheila goes over telling Hollis to throw down the pack and now she regrets it. Over with Ridge R.J. Forrester, Jr., he tells Katie about Luna's pack discovery. R.J. also explains that Poppy and Tom met the night of the overdose. R.J. also spills that Poppy told Luna she'd take matters into her own hands regarding Tom. R.J. thinks they need to find some evidence. Katie is induced this was no accident. BNB Recap Katie Logan's police cock Sheila and Deacon come from the reverse storehouse area. As they go to the front of the eatery, R.J. takes off. Sheila tells Katie that Hollis wanted her to look inside Tom's pack before he failed. Although Tom had a history of dependence, he was sober at I.L. Giardino. Sheila assumes they will no way know since the pack is in a tip. No. Sheila and Deacon return to their job duties. As soon as they're out of sound, Katie pulls out her phone to call Deputy Chief Bradley Baker. Poppy returns to the apartment. Luna demands to know how Tom's pack got there. Poppy keeps claiming she's not a killer. Poppy maintains that she has no indication how the pack got into their apartment. Luna reasons that whoever put the pack there must be responsible for the two deaths. Indeed though Poppy's story has holes, Luna says she believes her. After a clinch, Poppy declares that their history is being knocked down and the Spencer family is their future. The bold and the beautiful spoilers, Spencer detracted the bold and the beautiful recap for Friday, August 9th reveals that at the Spencer manse, Liam Spencer can tell Bill is detracted. Bill confesses he's concerned about Poppy. Bill can smell that commodity is bothering Poppy. Bill doesn't understand why Poppy won't tell him what's wrong. Liam is sure everything will be fine. Bill wants all three of his sons to accept Luna. Latterly, Katie meets with Bill. Katie tells him everything she knows. Bill is doubtful but listens to Poppy's history with Tom, the magical mints, the letters as well as the battle on the night of the death. Katie is certain that Poppy just wants Bill's plutocrat. Bill finds Katie's enterprises strange. Just as Katie tells Bill that he's sleeping with a killer, Poppy shows up.